this is who I am, I'm different, and I've learned to accept it fully. Meet incredible 23-year-old woman, Hanam Kaur, who's been growing a beard since the age of 16, and she says she's never felt more feminine. It's the way that God made me and I'm happy with it. Hanam from Slough has polycystic ovary syndrome, which can cause excessive hair growth. She was just 11 when it started appearing on her face. I would hide it um, by talking to people with my hands over my face. I used to wax it and that became really painful, so I would just shave it or use different sorts of creams. Um, I used to bleach it too. Hanam endured bullying at school and stares from people on the street. The names that people would call me were things like Beardo instead of Weirdo, um, She-Man, she male. She's even received death threats after posting videos about female facial hair on YouTube. I have had people um, telling me that they're going to burn me and they're going to throw a brick at me. At her lowest point, she began self-harming and even considered taking her own life. I would lock myself in my room. I didn't want people to see me because I knew that would lead to more stairs. But at the age of 16, everything changed for her Hanam when she took the decision to be baptised as a Sikh. We need to keep our bodies intact the way it was given by God. It was literally at the point where I had enough of people bullying me, uh, me feeling down, uh, me having suicidal thoughts, me self-harming. I just had enough. The decision proved controversial. Even Hanam's own family were against it at first. The concerns um, that my mum and dad had were I won't have a normal life, normal life I say, as a young girl should have. I won't get married. They were concerned about me getting a job, how, you know, there's no employers out there that will employ a baby lady or such. But she's found support in her 18-year-old brother, Gurdeep, and friend, Surinder. She's happy living her life, does what she wants to do. So it's really good for her. As long as she's happy, that's all I really care about. For me to see without the beard now, I think I'd be shocked. It wouldn't be the same person. So I think having the beard has probably given a lot of um, strength, etc., to be who she wants to be, to say what she wants to say, and, you know, just be happy. Her arm still has to endure stares in the street, and is often mistaken for a man. But she's learned to accept it. I do play around with it a little bit because sometimes when I go to the public toilets and someone goes to me, um, oh, this is a women's, and I actually put on a deep voice and I say, no, this is for men's. <laughs> so I kind of play around with it, and it's funny because we all end up laughing. Today, things are looking up for Hanam. She works as a primary school teaching assistant, and she's received dozens of messages from women and men around the world who say they love her beard. One guy saw my picture and he goes to me, will you marry me? And she hopes her story will encourage other women to be more body confident. This is me, this is who I am. It's my, it's my inner beauty, it's my outer beauty, it's my oneness, it's my wholeness. I'm different and I've learned to accept it fully.